<laughs> Bunch is living abroad here. Sharon speaking. Sharon speaking. Hello, darling. I'm Bronte. To I'm Bronte. To Hello, baby girl. What are you doing? <laughs> right, I'm supposed to be. <laughs> oh, I love you. I love you. Don't eat me. Don't eat me. She's really, she's really pleased because she's she's had her teeth done yesterday. Anyway, serious, serious. Sharon speaking. I'm Bronte. Bunch is living abroad. Oh dear. Now, if you've been with us for a few months, you will have seen the video with Nacho Ricabel on there where they spent the evening with us. And we managed to uh, go and visit them a few days ago. It was a marvellous day. We learned so much. And we watched them train up, well, rescue the horses and then train them up and how they do that. We had a barbecue. All sorts in this video. Give it a watch and I'll see you at the end. I do apologise for the wind. It's windy Mallorca. See you at the end of the video. Well, we're doing well. We've already missed it. Going round. Okay, so we're here. I'm just going to do a little bit of a circle. Steve's just going with the man. There he is. He's I've just asked him if he wants to be here. Yeah, because he was getting home tonight. But for now, this baby here, he's just been rescued. I'm in the dark, aren't I? But he's, he's just been put in the shade. He's just been rescued a few days ago with another one. And uh, apparently the scene's a bit local, a bit crazy. Yeah, so this one's, he's got a lot of work. They've got a lot of work to do with it. I know, darling, you tell him. He's gonna look gorgeous by the time he's finished, they're finished with him. He's very thin. What people do? Stop hiding. Look at him. So yeah, we'll get him sorted. Hello, baby. I know. I know what they've done to you, darling. Eh? Well, you're in the right place now. You're gonna look gorgeous. Gorgeous. You are. You're gonna have a good life now. He says, "Do you think so? Do you really think so?" Because at the moment, I haven't had one. It's been rubbish. Mm, and I'm not right pleased being standing here and the flies are getting at me oh look, right, I'm going to leave you alone this little man here he's herding the uh, the chick and we've got another one, so we've got lots of dogs oh hey we've got chicken this is right, moving on moving away from the crazy English girl They say in Spanish, but they are keen. Little by little. I'm just going to come a little bit closer. If you look. Isn't he beautiful? Oh, yeah. How are we getting there? Hello, sweetheart. But yeah, they rescued him, I think it's three years ago. He's doing well, apart from when he needs his feet doing. A little bit uh, nervous. Hey, 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 so they've just done it. It's been ever so good. A bit nervous, but they've persevered and they've got the feet done. What I think is a good idea. Have you seen this? This basket. Again, it's under the trees, but what a cracking idea that is. Everything in there. I need one of those, and then I'm well set up with my pinny. <laughs> and that too in the trees. It's really good. Cracking idea that. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, yeah. Thanks. No, you're not having that. I'm going to be shredded. I'm going to be shredded. Oh, love, I've just spoiled all your fun. Well, that's because I'm a woman, love. I'm supposed to do these things. Mmm, yeah. So he's just wrapped the strap round his legs just to see how he is. And I think he's going to do the same. Yes, he's doing the same the other way. Just letting the horse get used to what he's doing. He's put the strap through the stirrups. And he's going to do the same. Okay, no, he's not. Oh yeah, he's having a waggle. He's waggling. Okay. 
just letting them letting him get used to it that he's not gonna die that this happens giving him a stroke I don't know how I'm gonna get him in the bag I'll find a way <laughs> no, not if he carries on going in the ashtray is as bad as my husband while all this is going on, look at Neil, the man. Hello, baby. Hello. You good boy. Yes, you are. Look at you. <laughs> so, you can see, they're going to have to get used to dogs. Look at his head. Oh, I love him. So I would imagine that because they've only had him a few days, they're just working out what he wants to do, what he can't do, and what he's scared of. And now, I'd love to tell you what they're saying, but I haven't got a clue because they're speaking Mallorquin and I do not know what that is. Oh, no, what it is, I can't speak it. So, um, have you, the, the son? I've never seen him not smile yet. He's always smiling. Oh, maybe not now. <laughs> Bless him. Pock a pock, is he there? He's just gonna continue round. Oh, what is on? Oh, wow, well done. Well done, Happy. Well done. And he's three years old. This hot. Beautiful. Oh, I think, yeah, he's gonna ask him, he's asking him to trot. Doesn't help with the dogs. Which is good, because there has to be obstacles, doesn't there? <laughs> Stunning. Three years old, rescued two days ago. Complete crazy horse, they said. So I've said before, most of these are ex trotting horses. They've been taught right from the beginning that you don't canter when you're riding because if they canter they're disqualified from the race and he's only been on him what 10 minutes that is beautiful there we go we just got back off and back on again just need three people to help get two more people So yeah, it's just been confirmed. This is the first time that uh, Javi has been able to get on him. We've only had him for a few days. And he was nervous to start with. He's never cantered before. He used to pull a cart in the trotting arena. Brilliant. This is what they do. This is what they call resetting a horse. To be a horse. So he's three months old. <laughs> 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 
So these are all rescued? Uh, total rescate? Rescue? Casi todos. Sí, sí, sí. Casi todos. Hey you, hey you. Hace unos años muy delgado, solamente tenía huesos y moscas. Ah, sí. No tenía carne. Ah, sí. Oh, sí. Sí, 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 sí. Me faltaba poco para morir. Yeah. Okay. So, all these horses are rescued and they've been saved from being and changed into, turned into horse meat. Yeah. Right, we've got a bit of a catastrophe going off here now. The tractor, we're supposed to be using this tractor to save another tractor, but this tractor, can you see? It's got a piece of tree stuck in. So you can see if you can get your end in here, can you see? So we're stuck too. So we're just trying to get some rope. Oh! Um, yeah, we're just trying to, with no saw, we've got nothing. So we're just tying some rope round it to see if we can pull the tree away. Ah, it's all going off here, isn't it? Right, so we've just rescued ourselves off this one. This is what's stuck. And now we're going to rescue this one. I thought we were rescuing horses, not tractors. Yeah, um, quite um, intrigued on how they're going to get this out on such a small little way like this. Oof. Okay, so while we're waiting for the tractor to be mended, I'm going to show you something now, right? Can you see this little plant? Now this is like a fennel. And um, it's, well, it smells like fennel. And they call it yerbas here. Well, herbs. But the famous liqueur called yerbas is made out of this. It's green stuff. Green um, liqueur called yerbas. And you can get three types. One's mixed, one's sweet, and one's pretty damn sharpish. Uh, very good. I think it's a digestive, yeah. It's uh, for after you've had your meal and everything. But if you like me, you just drink it whenever you like. So this dog is uh, <laughs> playing with the stone. Steve's going to get fed up before the dog does. I think I'd better move. I don't want to trap in my face. Thank you. Oh yeah, as easy as that. the right uh, way around. Can you see this tunnel? This is the green stuff that the plant that I showed you on the video, this is what it makes. Good stuff, honestly. Yeah, so we had a fabulous time. We had a barbecue, as you can see. They also explained to us that they do rescue the animals and they train them back up. They call it resetting. And then to be able to fund this, they have a business where you can actually ride uh, for one, two, three days in the countryside, in the forest, or sometimes you can um, have an excursion on the beach. I'm going to put the details below uh, in the description and everything if you want any more details. It's a good course. It's an organically grown company. I really do 
think they're brilliant. So give us a thumbs up, give us a subscribe, I can never say that, and keep in touch. There should be a little circle with my face on it. If you press that, you'll be able to subscribe. See you soon.